the snubs and shocks of the 2023 ACM Awards. One of the biggest shocks was that Hardy was this year's most nominated artist and he even received nominations as a singer, songwriter, and producer. In addition, Kane Brown was nominated for Entertainer of the Year, and with this nomination, he became the first biracial artist to be nominated in 50 years. The ACMs also changed their Music Video of the Year award to Visual Media of the Year. They also added a new award called Artist Songwriter of the Year. Out of the nominees, it was a little shocking to see that Morgan Wallen received a nomination as he was not a writer on more than half of his music catalog. In fact, on his newest album called One Thing at a Time, he only wrote 13 out of the 36 songs. In addition, another big shock was that artists like Luke Bryan, Thomas Rhett, and Jelly Roll did not receive any of their own nominations. The winners consisted of Chris Stapleton as Entertainer of the Year, Lainey Wilson as Female Artist of the Year, Morgan Wallen as Male Artist of the Year, Haley Witters as New Female Artist of the Year, Zach Bryan as New Male Artist of the Year, Brothers Osborne as Duo of the Year, Old Dominion as Group of the Year, Lainey Wilson's album Bell Bottom Country won Album of the Year, Cole Swindell's song She Had Me at Heads Carolina won both Song of the Year and Single of the Year, meanwhile Hardy and Lainey Wilson's song Wait in the Truck won both Music Event of the Year and Visual Media of the Year, and finally Hardy won Artist Songwriter of the Year. So overall, Hardy and Lainey Wilson were the biggest winners of the night, each winning four awards. During the award show, there were a few surprise duets when Lainey Wilson came out to join Jelly Roll for his song Save Me, and when Luke Combs came out to join Ed Sheeran on his song Life Goes On. And then, after the award show, both of these duets were released. One big shock of the night was that Zach Bryan, an artist who has been releasing music since 2019, won New Male Artist of the Year. And as someone who has never really been a huge fan of award shows, he even tweeted out saying ACMs were amazing. Another big shock was that Luke Combs and Morgan Wallen, who are arguably the top artists of today's country music and who are currently on sold out tours, did not win Entertainer of the Year as it was awarded to Chris Stapleton. Chris Stapleton's win marks his first win as ACM Entertainer of the Year, and since he has already been awarded ACM New Male Artist of the Year and ACM Male Artist of the Year, he now qualifies to be awarded the ACM Triple Crown Award. After the award show ended, Chris even stayed later to help clean up. Dolly Parton closed out the award show with a debut performance of her new rock song called World on Fire. Recently, Dolly was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, and with this, she has decided to release a rock album titled Rockstar.